Hi guys, Artie here. So for this video, I will try to do something um, different because um, in our current game environment for the shimmer environment, actually every shimmer themselves have their own counter path already. So there's no specific asper or one shimmer can actually like dominate the whole um, PvP content. Other than Wuyu, Wuyu is kind of special for now, but Wuyu have her own counter as well. All right, which is herself. <laughs> okay, I'll go through um, this path here, which is by drawing a draft here. So I think it will be easier to let you guys know like who is countering who, what Esper or what kind of team build is countering the other Shimmer. All right, so uh, within here, I already listed down all the other sh uh, the Shimmer we have, but there's a special case for a few um, Esper here, which is going to be Feng Shun is going to be a flex spot because Feng Shun doesn't. Um, sorry, if not Feng Shun, Nusi. Nusi doesn't have a real, really have her own team because she is most likely being built in a Tolan team or being built in a uh, what's that called? Exodia team that uh, we don't really use uh, at the moment. So I'll put her at flex because sometimes you want her to be used, sometimes you doesn't want her. So I'll put her at flex and then Unus. I'll put her him in GVG only because in other than GVG content, you won't be really seeing Unus in uh, our meta. And then Everett here is being at jail because he is being useless. And most of the time, you want to use him is just for like um, some hit boost, but which is they're gonna remove at the next KO patch. And also in like championship or those stuff. But this one here, we're gonna talk about PP. So Everett will instantly be in the jail. We are not gonna talk about him. And then you can notice that in the corner here, I, I did put some of the Asper, which is they are not Shimmer, but they are worth to take into uh, the topic today, which is um, Momo, Jinchu, Suje, because they are the few only true damage Asper we are, we are using in the game. And then Mavis is the special girl for um, our combo. And then Chu Yao's um, passive, the Spirit Ace, is also pretty special that it's being used almost everywhere. So I will be putting them into the chart as well. Okay, so first thing I want to talk about, which is going to be <coughs> Wuyu. Alright, so Wuyu here, who is the first victim when Wuyu came out? It's Iki. Because Wuyu does a lot of breakdowns AoE, it actually kills Iki so easy that Iki uh, actually is uh, very afraid of Wuyu because of the AoE damage. But at the same time, Iki is actually a good counter to Anna. So I'll put Anna here. So Anna weakness is Iki because um, Anna will keep taking her action and then Iki will just slowly, slowly chip off Anna damage and kill Anna. Right, who else can counter Iki? It's gonna be Petros. Because of Petros passive, we'll be able to kill um, Iki's team. Um, usually you pair. Um, Iki with Mavis and Jinchu and Petros will just disable it and kill Iki very easily. And who else can counter Iki is gonna be Jiang Juli, JJ here. Because Jiang Juli random jump, it might actually jump on Iki and Iki will just die. But at the same time, Iki will counter JJ because Iki have this spell in his kit and he if he if JJ doesn't jump on Iki, Iki will um, dispel away JJ's standoff and just instantly kill JJ. And let's talk about more first about who can counter Iki. So Iki here can also be countered by Tolan plus Shenpin plus Raven. The Cleave team combo. Cause um, Raven is AoE damage, Shenpin have AoE damage as well. And then Tolan can ban Mavis away and just make um, them to be able to cleave Iki. So basically this current patch here, I'm not saying Iki is bad. Just that the Iki team himself is bad, but you can put uh, Iki in like Wuyu team together to make it more um, flexible together. Right, so let's export more, which is Wuyu team. Who is able to counter Wuyu? Wuyu team is able to counter by herself. Wuyu team vs Wuyu team. The same team can be countering each other. So it depends on who is stronger, who have the more build um, they have, and who will be better. Okay, Wuyu can counter themselves and also the true damage unit. So this true damage unit is not necessary to put them in within one team. They are usually spread around in the team. So they're not um, you won't really see three of them in one team here, but usually they are 
um, separate. Like Suje maybe in one team, then Momo in one team, then Jinchu in one team. But they are the true hard counter against them. So within this true damage here, that they're separate into two parts, which is the single target true damage, which is gonna be Jin, um, Jin Chiu, and the other one will be also Suje and Momo. So Suje and Momo can counter Anna. <laughs> okay, we'll counter Anna and then uh, Anna will counter Jin Chiu. So I'll just put it here. And I will counter Jin Chiu because Jin Chiu is um, just a single hit target and Jin Chiu will not able to um, kill Anna. No matter how strong a Jin Chiu is, you, it's just a matter of time you get killed by Anna. Then Anna will counter JJ because JJ is single hit and Anna have buff steal and also true damage in a hit can actually kill JJ very easily, especially Jiang Juli. Uh, single target when he goes into demon mode, it jumps on Anna. Anna will not take uh, most of the damage, and Anna will just S2 and then just take off uh, Jiang Julie's HP. So it doesn't really matter at all. And also, Anna will counter Petros. And Petros will get countered by Wii U. Then, uh, who else? Petros can. Basically, that's it, right? For Petros, most of the time, if in terms of Shimmer, Petros do doesn't really do um, anything else anymore. But maybe Petros can be like Tavern together in the team. And who else I miss? Cecilia. Cecilia wise, I will put her in Flex because that's not really a case for her to be. Um, used in our current meta unless you make like a very solid stall, uh, stall team or revive team to keep um, Cecilia strong or else I don't really see a need in Cecilia then the rest here I would say pretty much is cover right oh um, Raven can be put in here as well because they Petros need the cleave so I'll put something like this but they will get countered by Wii for sure this is for sure Okay, so this is pretty much the basic of the current uh, meta, the counter path. It's not totally complete because like, um, for example, this cliff team here will actually get countered by um, Wu Yu as well. Because uh, if you don't, you're not able to kill Wu Yu, which most likely you won't, and then you actually get countered by Wu Yu. So, but this is roughly how the current meta looks like uh, within the, between the shimmers. Alright, so if you don't see them within the um, within the chart here, doesn't doesn't mean that they are not being used. Like Tavern doesn't mean like it's have to be paired with ta um, ta um, Petros, but if Petros have Tavern together, it's actually a very good um, combo as well. But this is pretty much the rough the rough idea about the current um, Shimmer counter. Alright, so let me um, expand the the combo. All right, so after understanding this um, basic. Um, draft now I'm going to hide this part here I'll go into a more advanced version so what kind of advanced version I'm going to go for now um, so let's say the previous one here all right maybe I'll make this small and just then I'll put a side so you can always refer back if you want I'll put a side uh, let's say here yeah I'll put it here all right so let's talk more about um, this part here so Let's say you, you actually meet a team like um, Wu Yu and you want to fight if you have using Wu Yu but if you actually put in Momo plus Wu Yu you are actually directly counter instead of this situation like this situation is only Wu Yu plus Wu, uh, Wu Yu fighting Wu Yu purely okay so but if you have Momo in your team here you're actually directly counter to Wu Yu but at the same time if the enemy is using Wu Yu but with a Iki in the team here, if they pair these two together, they are actually countering this team here. Because Iki uh, will counter the one who take a lot more action and Momo usually will be the one who take more action. So Iki will be a very safe spot to counter Momo. But at the same time, if you put in um, Wuyu and Suje in a team here, you are actually countering uh, sometimes, okay, not always. You always uh, you'll have a chance to actually counter the Iki here. Okay, so because Suje is a, um can 
um, do um, true damage and then um, Suje will also do AoE damage that will also it will um, highly um, damage Iki in a way all right so this will be our current uh, Momo sorry not Momo uh, our current Wuyu meta situation so this one counter this this one counter this and then when Suje is here and usually uh, then here comes um, Chuya so Chuya with um, Wu Yu plus uh, who's that called? Suje will counter this Suje team because Su um, Chuya will protect Suje from getting crit, and then this, this Suje will not get protected by uh, any Chuya. Uh, sorry, uh, Chuya's passive. So this Suje will get crit. So this Wu Yu team. Breakdance will most likely kill Suje, but Suje here will not be um, Suje Wuyao team here will not easily kill uh, the team that we have Chuyao here. But at the same time, this team here plus Chuyao will will counter Suje because Momo is a true damage expert. So this true damage here will not get affected by Chuyao's passive, so it won't really uh, matter that they um this suja is protected by true or not because um we put true out here is true out spirit against will protect suja suja will not get crit but momo doesn't care momo is a true damage momo doesn't crit so it would just go bypass um true um, spirit against and kill suja but at the same time again this team here plus a true yao um let me put in in front so this team here plus okay never mind i'll put it like this so this team here plus chu yao with iki and then this chu yao will protect iki will counter momo so that's a kind of a cycle now and then this one here will get countered by by uh the the suje version um let me make it small teen and then pull then this one will get countered here so this is the current Wu Yu meta counterpath each other. So instead of this basic version, so because this light is a game that we can actually um, customize our own team, and this version here, this normal Suje version can actually spread out with a lot other combo as well. And if you want, you can actually put Jin Chu into action as well. I saw some team here, like something like this, will also be annoying with a suja here something like that and this one here will counter him <laughs> okay and this one can also counter them as well but not always they can also counter back they can also counter back so this pretty much the cycle so i would more consider that um um jinchu here is more like a flex unit they can put into it but most of the time it's only this three asper and then you uh then they will include um Lian and sakura so these two asper here are most likely with with any of the combo here they are like the mixed co fixed combo within the wuyu team here so yeah uh I, I would say that the current meta which is the pvp for wuyu there's a lot of um choices around to be um, built instead of just Wuyu, Wuyu Sakura Lit itself because they are more flexible to actually build with. So that's all for the video here. I, I hope the video actually doesn't comp doesn't um, confuse you, you guys or too complicated because sometimes when I go through the draft, I also will complicate myself. But this will be the roughly um, stream counter for each part. And then this is the Wuyu itself. The Wuyu team itself in the counter that I feel like it because that's what I experiment and what I get as the final outcome. Okay, so hope you guys enjoy the video and see you guys in the next video. Bye bye. Special thanks for the direct support on the YouTube membership. So for the benefactor of Artier, which is Gen MP, Rosas15, Moncult Rajali, The Bluest Trelane, Pidget Roulette, Kemi, thank you so much for the support. And for the supporter and patron of Artier, which is Louis Schneider, Acne, Code Wilderness, Wang Tamer, Ziggy, Kamaruki, Sunwalks, Rimu, Chonny, Von Hexa, Luxley, Rosen Bassi, Antonio Winterspoon, Marilyn Williams, and Uncle Chad. 
And that's not all, also special thanks for the direct support on the live stream super chats. This chat here is only for the latest 10 super chat uh, member will be listed here. So thank you for Acne, Chawny, Ziggy, Pidgeot's Relate, Code Wilderness and Rosas15. Thank you so much for the support and hope you guys enjoy the video. Bye bye.